Now, the other thing that's a major factor, and by the way, these points apply to healers and to mediums. All right, so these points really apply to both. But the other main factor, obviously, which is connected to humility, is your emotional condition. <coughs> now, the problem with most mediums on earth is they have he very heavy judgments about emotional condition. And the reason why they have very heavy judgments is because almost every single spirit on the natural love path has heavy judgments about emotions. So what's happening for most mediums is the spirit who's looking after them and nurturing their condition, their guide if you like, has huge judgments about you becoming emotional. And that spirit now is impressing heavily on this medium. And the medium therefore often has heavy judgments about you being emotional. Now, if that's the case, how are they going to help you with your emotions? Well, what they're going to say to you is, oh, write down what you're feeling, roll it all up in a little thing, and burn it, and then you're done. <laughs> or things like that, to that nature, right? They're going to suggest to you that dealing with emotions is an intellectual process. Right? Because for that natural love spirit, it has been an intellectual process. But that is not the way for you to develop your mediumship. The problem is that most mediums are so focused on not developing their emotional condition, from detuning from their emotional condition, from staying in their intellect, that that severely limits what kind of information can be transmitted to them. It also, if I'm a, if I'm a healer, severely limits my ability to heal. Because again, if I have certain emotions of judgement in me, let's say I have judgement of a single mother. A mother, a mother has a baby, but she's not married. Right? That's my judgment. I'm a healer. And this mother who's not married comes along wanting to be healed. What's the main thing she's got to get? My judgment. Right? And if I can't actually recognise my own emotional condition and my judgment and actually say to her, well, in modesty, I don't know if I'm ready to treat you yet because because I have this condition inside of me that prevents me from treating you. If I'm not willing to say that in modesty, then I'll probably try to treat her, but it's not going to be of much benefit to her receiving all this judgment at the same time. Right? So can you see how your emotional condition will have a huge effect upon the effectiveness of what you're doing, whether you're a healer or a medium? <coughs> 